Hello viewers, welcome back to News Meter. Today we have Dr. Kuldeep Raizada with us to talk about conjunctivitis. Dr. Kuldeep Raizada is a licensed ocularist in Hyderabad and also a CEO and chairman of Akriti Group. Thank you for joining News Meter today, sir. Right, thank you. So my first question to you is what exactly is conjunctivitis? Conjunctivitis right now actually is spreading very fast for many reasons, but actually it's nothing but the inflammation of the eye. It can happen for various reasons. So sometimes, you know, the big call like red eyes, you know, red eyes have people are happening it, but red eyes happen because of the pollen allergy or the bacteria or virus. So these are the small causes, especially when the rain just season is going on and this kind of bacteria virus, they grow very rapidly. And uh, many times this is happening because of the poor hygiene. People are not able to maintain the hygiene because they are meeting, shaking hands with the people. If somebody have little of red eye and he's rubbing the eye all the time and without understanding of his knowledge that actually he's spreading this bacteria and virus to the people's hand. They are going to the washrooms, you know, open the tap and without uh, understanding some many times you know people go to watch in public places they don't use even a soap they just clean the you know hands with the water and just come out but they don't understand the tap is being touched 100 times with 100 people and you know even one person have a conjunctivitis it is spread very very rapidly so is you know it it is not very serious but it can be very serious if it's been neglected to the people it is normally uh, if somebody have a red eyes right now red eyes is being a hot topic in the in india yeah. in technically ground if people have a little lot of redness they feel and the eyes start watering or a little kind of discharge is coming up they should use a light dose of uh, antibiotic like a moxifloxacin or ciprofloxacin for two or three times a day and that should be able to sort out in spite of like it is start growing onto the next level you know like the inflammation get increased and keep waiting that something is happening it if you suspect that the eyes start getting red, especially it happened with always with one eye, not with both the eyes. So one eye is getting red and you feel that it's happening. So you just put a little dose of antibiotic hydro for three or four days. Seems to be settled down. And if you feel that the, the problem increase on technically, then it's a challenging job. Then you should see an ophthalmologist right away. So anybody is having this kind of technical issue, just make sure maintain personal hygiene. Make sure that no sharing of the cloth and towels with the friends and family. If you are going in public places, make sure that you use a soap and water to clean your hands. And uh, technically ground, make sure just use your protective glasses. Why this condition is spreading now and not throughout the year? What's so specific about this? Is it the rainy season or untimely rains that we are facing? So uh, do we need to panic about this? Because, uh, you know, as we have noticed that there are a lot of social media misinformation messages that uh, no eye drop can cure this condition and, you know, no, no amount of medication can kind of stop this uh, conjunctivitis from spreading. So can you put some light on this? No, no, it's a myth actually. You know, this is basically, as I said to you before, this is bacteria and virus infections. So if you are in an early stage, you know, as I said, you at the moment you have feeling of inflammation and pulling a redness or the, you know, watering the discharge, you can put a drop of the antibiotic, it will resolve it. It's not anything which is very seriously involved. Very rarely cases you have a different kind of virus or bacteria which can cause. But technically this is season right now. This is a humidity because of the rain is happening it and which is causing and the pollen actually settled down from the air to the things and that causing this kind of uh, deconjunctivitis. And it does not happen throughout the year, especially this is the time between July, August, this is the most common and it's happening all over the places when the, the season is like this. So when it is a atmosphere is humid that you were expected to have like this. Yeah, and actually if we see this is not a like new condition that we are facing. This is something, you know, we have seen since we were child children. Yeah, yeah. So what are the precautions that we can take to avoid uh, conjunctivitis? Like as you have already mentioned, avoid uh, like wash your hands and all. But then uh, there is a misconception uh, among people as you uh, really mentioned that, uh, you know, making eye contact spreads it. So can you put some light on that? Yeah, eye contact is not uh, spreading any conjunctivitis ever. As I told you, the reason that uh, people feel that you should not go with the bare eyes because, you know, the water is coming and somebody has got a conjunctivitis, he is having a watering in the eye and he, because of unwantedly the fingers keep going on the eye. And that is an area that actually their hand is already contaminated with the tears and the virus or bacteria. And uh, this is how it is spread. So it is not happening eye to eye contact. 
so that's the reason if you have an red eyes start wearing your glasses so so what could be the uh, proper treatment to treat this condition rightly and not you know depending on home remedies that we have like taking some otc eye drop or something like that no home remedies are not otc eye drop home remedies no, 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 like uh, using some home thing. remedies like uh, i have heard that uh, capsule white colored capsule that people use it has a wax inside and then they put it in your in their oh, eyes no 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 we should not be looking those kind of thing because those can be very dangerous the home remedies people prefer to put red eyes rose water those kind of things and that can actually aggravate the condition to any you know the chances that people can even lose the eyesight so never yeah. try those kind of home remedies for conjunctivitis story you should have the over the counter you can have otc you know the eye drop like as i told you the basic antibiotics ciprofloxacin or moxifloxacin they will be able to the first line of activity to begin as i said first 24 hours is crucial if you feel that the red eye is going on and you put the start putting the antibiotic eye drop and first 24 hours things are not getting improved you should go and see the ophthalmologist not to wait any more further all right sir. so thank you for connecting with us today and uh, it was really insightful having a conversation with you thank you so much sir pleasure seeing you thank you so much have a wonderful day bye bye thanks for more such informative interviews with medical professionals follow newsmeter.in also if you want to see an interview on a particular medical condition please comment below